hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you people are doing good and i am also doing great so friends today i have come up with this super soft glam makeup tutorial so actually it was a requested video so if you want to know how i created this look then let's move on to the video so first of all i'm just going to brush my eyebrow hair with the help of a spoolie and today for my eyebrow again i'm using my all-time favorite innisfree eyebrow pencil and i'm drawing my eyebrow in this way and if you want to draw your eyebrow upward you just need to comb your eyebrow hair downwards and fill in the gap above so this is the right trick to draw your eyebrow now I'm going to apply my sunscreen as it is summer. I'm using the Aroma Magic sunscreen which is paraben free and chemical free. So this is a very important step during the summers. And now for my foundation I'm going with my all time favorite that is the Maybelline 24 hour foundation. This is a full coverage foundation and it's one of my favorite one and going to blend it with a damp beauty blender. And for my concealer today I'm going with the Fit Me concealer that is also from Maybelline in the shade 10 Fair and I'm going to draw it in this way. So when you apply your concealer in this way in an upward direction it will uh, make an illusion of elongating your face that it makes your face look slimmer. Now I'm going to dip my sponge in the translucent powder and going to set the concealer so that it does not crease and for my contouring today i'm taking this palette mixing these two colors and going to first apply the con uh, contour powder over here so when you apply your contouring or when you're applying any type of contour do take it upwards because in this way your face will tend to look slimmer and now it's time to dust off the excess translucent powder which we had left for five minutes and now you can see the difference now for my blusher i'm taking my all-time favorite blusher from color bar and it's a matte illusion blusher and i'm taking this also in an upward direction and going to apply it over my nose and over my chin just to give a sun-kissed look and for my highlighter i'm taking my all-time favorite highlighter i think you must uh, know it till now it's from swiss beauty and it's a super warm pigmented a highlighter or a multifunctional palette and for my eyebrow today I'm taking this palette from wet n wild I'm taking this brown color uh, over my crease just going to dab it in like so and uh, going to apply it over my whole eyelid so actually it's a type of a nude makeup so today I'm not using any bright color And whenever you apply any type of eyeshadow, take the product very less minimum and try to blend it out. In this way, you'll get the right shade on your eyes. And I'm just taking this dark brown color and just going to highlight my outer corner like so. And I'm just blending the product. And now with the help of a clean brush, I'm just going to blend these two colors together so that there are no harsh lines. Uh, so it's better to do with a clean brush now I'm going to take again this brown color and just going to tight line my lower waterline so I'm not applying any black kajal directly first I'm going to apply this brown shade on my lower lash line like so And then I'm applying this kajal that is on NYB and going to apply a very thin stroke of kajal. I'm not blending the kajal today. And today I'm going to apply my falsies and you can see how beautiful the eye makeup is looking. And I'm going to take this felt tip eye pencil and going to put it in my inner corner and just apply it to hide the lash band. And now for my mascara again I'm going on with my Maybelline mascara that is my favorite one. And I think Maybelline comes out with very good mascaras. And for my lips I'm first drawing on my lip first i'm just going to outline it with the help of a lip liner and i'm taking at least two shades brighter lip liner than my lipstick and for my lipstick today i'm taking this beautiful shade from mac and this is one of my favorite one and when it comes to nude makeup when you apply this type of lipstick shade then it goes very well with the makeup and you can see how beautiful the makeup have come out and this is one of my favorite lipstick 
and I'm going to mention all the sheets and the product in my description box you can check it out as well and today I'm just going to apply this lipstick from wow a bit in the middle of my lips just to give it a glossy effect and uh, i always mix and match my two lipsticks in this way your lipstick comes out with very different and lovely color and to finish it up i'm just going to spray my setting spray that is Monsieur's beauty and guys my makeup is complete you can see it looks so fantastic and voila this is the final look uh, this is going to look very subtle during the summers and it's very easy i think to create and it does not look at all heavy and it gives you that uh, very classy look and i hope you people will uh, do this makeup during the summers and don't forget to tag me if you are friends with me in any social media handle and uh, do comment in the comment section that how did you find my makeup and please do love me the same way and uh, till next time it's bye bye take care of yourself love yourself and meet you in the next video till then stay safe